when we think about happiness, we should be thinking about it as not the absence of suffering, but the ability to rebound from it, about resiliency, about empathy, about the um, ability to have conflict resolution versus conflict avoidance. That's healthy in the workplace, and that's what happiness is. Ha happiness is like fog. We can see it, we know it's there, but we can't wrap our hands around it. It's about being able to recognize it when it's in front of us, and the higher the psychological fitness and the higher capacity that we have in our emotional intelligence, the more readied we are to actually see happiness when it's in front of us. Having mindfulness and having well-being initiatives are very important, but we need to get to the root of really what is making fee people feel depressed and anxious. And that goes back to that we aren't thinking proactively about why people are unhappy at work. And it always goes back to that we haven't been able to build in the skills of psychological fitness and the ability of, to cope and to be thinking about our emotional intelligence in a way that is preventative. And every time I think about why I'm here and why I'm motivated, I think about the fact that we can have post-traumatic stress or we can have post-traumatic growth. Both of them are options and that it's a fundamental choice that we have to think about how we're going to live our life and if we're gonna to choose to be happy.